let's have a look at some of the science behind a glow stick. A glow stick relies on a chemical reaction. The chemical reaction occurs between hydrogen peroxide and a chemical compound known as diphenyl oxalate. Glow sticks also contain a special dye that can absorb and emit energy. A glow stick works because it has two separate chambers. It has an outer plastic container and an inner thin glass tube. In this example, the inner glass tube contains the colored dye as well as the diphenyl oxalate. In this bowl, I've put the hydrogen peroxide and you'll see that when I add the dye and the diphenyl oxalate to it, it illuminates and glows. I thought it'd be really cool to put this under the microscope and see if we can see any of the carbon dioxide gas as a byproduct of the reaction. So to a glass slide, I added the hydrogen peroxide. I then added some of the dye and the diphenyl oxalate to the slide and was able to observe the reaction real time. It was really cool. See, when the glass inner tube is snapped, the hydrogen peroxide of the glow stick can react with the oxalate and it releases carbon dioxide and energy. The energy is then released into the surrounding environment, which contains the dye. And the dye absorbs this energy and re-emits it as light. And that's how we get a glow stick. In this footage, you can definitely see the carbon dioxide. It's really cool. It confirms that this is how the reaction works. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you really enjoyed the footage. Drop a comment below, let me know what you think. I'd love to hear some suggestions for future videos.